Welcome to the video tutorial of Easy Burp, a desktop-based restaurant management software. In this video, we will learn about inventory wastage management. Inventory waste refers to the waste produced by unprocessed inventory. The majority of food wastage in restaurants happen when the raw materials are not stored properly, which leads to their decay. In Easy Burp, the inventory wastage can be managed from wastage function. To manage inventory wastage from Easy Burp, go to Easy Burp Back Office. Select the main store. On the left hand side select the store. Inventory transaction. Wastage. Wastage tab. There are few filter criteria which the user can use to search the item. Select the date. Item category. Select item type as inventory for items excluding intermediate. Select intermediate to search only intermediate items. Select all to get all the items list. Check mark on show inactive items to search inactive items. Under item information, add the wastage. And remark. Once all the wastage are added select the outlet, or store from where the inventory needs to be deducted. If on outlet is used, select the outlet from the drop down menu. If on store is selected then the inventory will be deducted from the store on which the user is logged in. Select the date, and click on fetch from physical stock data of date. To update the inventory wastage as per the physical stock variance. Thus, all the negative variance will be added as the wastage. Click on Yes. Click on Fetch from Issue Voucher. To update the wastage done while issuing the items, select the voucher from the list which was wasted due to issuing and click on OK. Thus the wastage will be updated under the item information. Click on Fetch from Buffet. To update the wastage done in the buffet, select the buffet. The buffet item will fetched. If multiple buffets are scheduled on same date, the user can select the buffet scheduled at to fetch particular buffet as per the buffet selected, add number of adults and child. Click on OK. The wastage will be updated as per the buffet. Click on Add to add the wastage. Click on Correction. Here the list of all wastage items added from EZPOS back office will be displayed. The user can select Date Filter, Outlet, Session, Item Name, and click on Search. To search for wastage item list, the list will be displayed below. The user can delete the item by selecting the item and clicking on Delete. The user can fetch a report by selecting items from list and clicking on Report. In case if user wishes to do operation in bulk, the user can select all the items from the list by clicking on Select All and then Fetch report or delete the items. This is how the user can manage the wastage occurred in a store. Thank you for watching the video tutorial. If you have any queries or feedback, kindly contact our 24-7 live chat support.